Now, the founder of Dave's Killer Bread is in custody this morning after deputies say he rammed into their vehicles and hurt three deputies overnight. Our Brent Weisberg joining us live with more on what happened here. Brent, good morning. Chad, good morning to you. The Washington County Sheriff's Office says that this was a very serious situation and potentially more charges could be filed once this case goes to a grand jury. We know that right now, Dave Dahl, the co-founder of Dave's Killer Bread, is behind bars in the Washington County Jail. He is expected to make his first court appearance later this afternoon. This all started last night around 10 o'clock, according to sheriff deputies. They responded to a home in the Cedar Mills neighborhood on a report that he was acting erratically inside a home and that a friend had called 911. When deputies got to the home, they encountered a black Cadillac Escalade. Deputies say that Dahl was inside that vehicle and immediately rammed a sheriff's patrol car head on. That's when a pursuit got underway. Deputies say that Dahl was slamming on his brakes, trying to get the deputy behind him to hit his vehicle. In all, three deputies had to go to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. They were treated and then released. Deputies had to use a taser, and they say that he resisted arrest. That taser, according to deputies, had little effect. Again, he has been booked into the Washington County Jail on charges that include second-degree assault and resisting arrest. We have more information on this story on our website at coin.com. Reporting live this morning, I'm Brent Weiss for Coin 6 News. Brent, thank you. You can follow along on coin.com or...